car theft for dummies. This video shows how quick and easy car theft can be with a keyless entry system. This is how it works. One person extends the range of the key fob left somewhere in the house. The thief's accomplice can then open and start the car within a matter of seconds. When you have a car with a keyless entry system, you just carry your key fob in your pocket. Once you're within two to three meters of the car, it will recognize the key fob, unlock upon touching the door handle and start when the driver sits in the car. To steal this kind of car, all you need is to extend the range of the key fob from a few meters to several hundred meters. The car thinks that the key is quite near. All you need to do is start and within seconds drive off without leaving any visible traces. ADAC wants to find out, are keyless entry systems really that easy to trick? The unsuspecting victims are sitting in a cafe with the key fob on the table. Now, all the fraudster has to do is sit nearby with a simple range extender. The second thief, waiting outside, opens the car door unnoticed and drives off. This theft method worked well in the ADAC test. The thief can drive the stolen car until it runs out of fuel, or if he simply leaves the engine on while refueling, he can virtually drive forever. In other words, taking the stolen car out of the country is no problem. ADAC had a simple wireless extender built for the test. Every day, ADAC examines brand new cars for the ADAC auto test car reviews. The results so far are disillusioning. So far, we've tested over 20 vehicles of more than a dozen brands, and in each case we're able not only to open the car within seconds, but also to drive off illegally. ADAC calls on car manufacturers to remedy the problem, and to systematically protect car electronics by measures which are already standard elsewhere.